Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for whenever it resonates. This reading is not time specific, and it is not sign specific. We are just going to see what comes up. We have the Hermit. This is a need to go within to figure out where you're going, what you're doing, if you're on the right path. It's a time of reflection. It's a it's a time to uh, refocus, uh, become self aware of of who you are. So it's a time of of self awareness, really. Um, it looks like to me like this person is um, becoming enlightened. Right? It's like this person is seeing the light. They're seeing the light. They're seeing the light um, through introspection. Okay. This person has been in a really, I feel like this person has been in a really dark place. They have. And they needed to get away, or they need to get away. They need time. Somebody needs time. They need time to reflect. They need time to think. Alone. Alone. With no interruptions. To become awakened. You need time to think about who you are and who you want to be, you know? That's what this is telling me. So I feel like we have somebody here that may be going through an awakening or they need to take time, to a time out. It's like we need a time out here. Um, ooh, this is beware of false, false beginnings. This is really think about it. And this is think, think, think too. Because you see, think. Think about what you're doing. Think about the consequences of your actions. Okay, you got to think about the consequences of your actions here. All right, that crystal ball does it because it's so bright or the light or something like that. I'll do it like this. You'll be able to see it. Anyhow, you see, he's saying, hold up, hold up. Are you, are you wise? Are you being wise with your decisions? Are you thinking about it before you choose? Are you moving too fast? Slow down. Think about this for a second. Is this the wisest path? Is this the wisest decision? Do you realize what the consequences will be? Will you have regrets if you don't think about this? Okay, so that's what this is saying. Beware. Beware of false beginnings. Make sure you are You're going to be asked to make a choice. That's what's going to happen. Think about your think about your response. Take time. If, if, if it's something that you, okay, somebody asks you something and you have to think about it for even a second, okay? You're thinking about it and you're like, geez, I'm crying. I don't know. I just don't know. Take more time. Take more time to think about it. Say, you know, give me, give me a few hours to think about this. And then go think about it by yourself without any, any interruption. So when you are presented with this option... Because you're going to be presented with a choice. So when you get presented with this, <laughs> go sit in your car or go someplace, wherever you got to go, where there's nobody around and take time to think about it. Where nobody is whispering in your ear telling you what to do. So you're going to be asked to make some sort of choice. Really think about the consequences. Make sure that you are making the right choice before you leap. Ooh. Death. Death. So death is an ending, right? It is. So it's an ending and it's a new beginning. It's a card of transformation, release, and change. Major life change. Everything changes. I'm going to have to shut my phone off. I'm sorry. One second. If I don't shut it off, I'm not going to stop calling. So we have an ending here. Be careful. Be careful. Mm -hmm. Justice. Wow. Karma. Justice, a final something. This is a final ending. 
This is a final. You can think of justice. You're in court, whatever. There's, there's a, something becomes final. Okay? So this is justice. Now, this is consequences. Karmic consequences. Karmic ending. Wake up. Be Beware. Be aware. The hermit is about awareness. This is also somebody that is very, very, very wise. This is somebody that is consciously aware. This is a very highly awakened individual. So we could have a highly awakened individual that is making a choice. Oh my God. This could, this, 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 this could be a judge. It could be somebody in authority. It could be a higher power. Okay. So, so just, just, uh, step back. Okay. And think about your choices. You don't want to end up with legal problems. Okay. Somebody could be facing some legal issues and there's consequences. Okay. So just be, just be careful. Okay. This is legal, uh, implications, right? Now this is a death. This is the, this is the death of something, the end of something. It's final. It's finally, it's finally over. So something may be finally over, whatever that means to you. Hmm. Could be a partnership. Okay, this could be a split. Somebody could be getting divorced. Could be breaking up from somebody they work with. Could be a partner. Two partners are breaking up. They're splitting. It's a split. It could be somebody that you work for. Somebody, you know, whatever. Okay, this is a split between two people. This is on thin ice. And it's really cold here. And this is cold as well. So we have some energy of being really, really cold and withdrawn as well. Somebody may have been on thin ice. They may have been coming close to the edge. They may have been on the edge of a breakup for a while. And because this is on the edge and it, this is about going through. So it's like somebody may have been on the edge and now it's like, it's time. It is time. This is an element of confusion and illusion. So somebody may have been living in some sort of fantasy or in some sort of illusion or they may have been confused or they may have been unsure of what they wanted to do. But now this is a final decision. So this is a final choice, okay, about a partnership that is not compatible. There could be, it's like this is somebody that is very, very wise that may be seeing that somebody is not stable, Okay, or that something isn't stable. This person knows. This person's been around a long time. You can't. This person has been around a long time. Somebody may have been on thin ice. Maybe they lie because this is a card of illusion. Maybe they lie or they make a wrong choice or whatever. And now they fa they're going to face some legal uh, punishment for... making the wrong choice but this is a card of news this could be good news for some of you it will be good news somebody may be receiving an offer or an invitation or something like that now this is an exciting opportunity to go someplace else somebody is going to be receiving an exciting opportunity that is just like wow this is great so that's what this is but this is a death okay so this is a death a death is an ending ending of, of a, one partnership okay so some, there is going to be a split on one hand there's going to be a split but somebody is going to be like oh it's very happy about this decision that is made okay so a choice is going to be made somebody's going to be happy about it oh this is the four of swords and many card death and many death and many decks the four of swords is the one laying on the on the casket okay not in this deck but so we know what the Four of Swords is. The Four of Swords is, is typically, you know, this is a dead end. And it's bone right here. 
So somebody may be ill, they may be sick, they may be um, close to death or feeling dead inside, feeling empty. Um, This is a need, to, again, this is a need to take a break, a need to heal, a need to rejuvenate, a need to live, a need, a need to regain health after perhaps being in a dead-end situation. Two of Wands reverse. Now this, is, this could be a sudden departure or a sudden arrival. There's a better level of indecision, but I think the choice is finally being made. Somebody is going to be really happy with this. I think it's, it could be a legal decision. Somebody in the in the law, okay, somebody in the court system or whatever, or a very wise individual is making a choice. If it's not the law, it could be act, the actual person that is making a choice after being in, maybe they were uh, bamboozled. Because <laughs> I keep feeling like that's the word I need to say is bamboozled by another person. It's like they just like, no, 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 no. You might be able to fill everybody up with else help with your illusions, but you can't fool me. So that's what I just heard. Um, this is this is a dead end. The need a need to recover, a need for healing. Okay, somebody needs to take a break and they need to uh, get their health back by the looks of things. Somebody was dealing with a person that was very sneaky, somebody that had hidden agendas. They put the, somebody's been in a repression or they were dealing with a person that put them in a repression with the high priestess reverse. Now that's a loss of self. It is. And I can see that it's a really dark energy right here. It's like somebody was being, I feel like we have somebody here that was in a dead end situation with somebody that was kind of like an energy thief or a, a psychic vampire or somebody like that that was was holding them down this person was was keeping them trapped and i don't need the eight of swords to see that um and it's like now and they've been in a state of confusion but it's like now somebody is seeing the situation clearly and this is good news it's good news because i feel like Whoever has been under somebody else's spell, it's like the spell is being broke. They're being broken free from this. Um, well, this person is um, evil, okay? E I mean, that's the only way I can say it. We have somebody here that is evil, and they keep secrets, and they're a liar, Oh, we definitely have a major completion here with the world and the death card. Okay, it's the end. It's over. This this journey is done. It's over. Somebody is about to learn a major life lesson. Seriously, a major life lesson. And it's like karma and justice is going to be served. Okay? Somebody has been uh, being... It's like they've been being watched. This is a watchman. They've been wa being watched and they were on thin ice. They may have been lying about a partnership or lying about a commitment or lying about a marriage or lying about something. And it's like the truth comes out. The secret gets revealed on one... Somebody's... And it could be... It could even involve a child. I don't know. But it's somebody's going to be really happy with this decision that is going to be made because this is ending. This is with the death and the world card we have a major ending here it's this is a dead end we have somebody that is is probably in very poor health they are ill um they've been unable to break free or they've been able unable to make a change they've been stuck in this predicament maybe they were trapped there by another person like maybe even against their will i don't i don't know that for sure but that's what just came out of my mouth so anyway um this two of wands there's there's some sort of disappointment um there could be some sort of uh
somebody gets stopped. It's like they get stopped or something like that. This is the, but anyway, we have an ending here. This is a major ending. This is, this is also final. So this is final and this is final. So we have something that is becoming final. This is like stepping over the finish line. It's done. It's over. Um, we have a major completion, which leads to a, a, the, a brand new life. Okay, we do have a brand new life here that starts after something ends because it's like a decision is made because it's the right it's it's the right thing to do. Okay, this is a final decision, whatever it is. Now, this is a card of perseverance and strength and stamina. This is somebody that is very strong and independent and has worked really, really hard and fought hard to prove themselves. This person never gives up. And this is an, uh, an offer of love. This is somebody coming in with emotional support or an emotional or a real offer of love. This person is kind and compassionate and gentle and loving this person is strong very very strong and never gives up and it looks like this person that has been wounded and, and is still standing it's like this person is going to get this is like a gift of love okay this is a gift of love it is so this person's been on their own by themselves waiting and it's like here it comes here it comes so somebody may be getting some love that they've been waiting for They've been waiting. I just said that. I don't need to say it again. It happens all the time. Anyway, this is karmic justice. Somebody's about to get exactly what they deserve for this person that has not given up and has continued to fight and stand up for themselves. Even if they were standing alone, they are going to receive a lovely offer so somebody's going to receive something that makes them <laughs> all warm inside i don't know where that's coming from um somebody's going to be receiving a message from somebody that they've been waiting for and it's and it's and it's It may have to do with an ending, a major ending. It could be even a death. You know, it, it's it's the ending of something. They're going to receive, somebody's going to receive a message that something has ended. Finally, it's finally, finally, finally over. That's just what I want to keep saying. Oh, goodness. The Knight of uh, Wands. This is uh, something happening very, very fast. Sudden. A sudden movement. This is sudden, sudden entrance. Something is suddenly arriving. Like, out of nowhere. Out of nowhere. Here it is. So. Hmm. And it feels like there's been some sort of abandonment. This could even be somebody that has abandoned you in the past or was left behind that is that is showing up. Maybe they left you behind or something like that. It's like, okay, here I am. Here I am. It's like all of a sudden, here they are. So there could be a sudden entrance. Suddenly somebody arrives. Some sort of truth is coming out. Some sort of, seriously, some sort of truth is coming out. And it's very good news for the other person that was being deceived. So whoever was lying could end up behind bars. Okay. This is a karmic, karmic lesson so somebody is learning a karmic lesson the hard way for making poor choices there's going to be a split and when i say there's a split it could be between anybody 
It could be between business partners. It could be between, be between lovers. It could be, be between parent and child. It could be between siblings. It could be between best friends. There's going to be a split. Somebody is probably uh, leaving just like that. And they are headed someplace else. Okay? They are headed someplace else. And it's a very sudden, quick decision. There could also, I mean, we get the death card up here, you know, finally over. So something is ending and it's very significant. When you get the world card, this is significant. It's like this journey is over and this is a, a, a huge phase. So this is something big like a marriage or a partnership that you were in for a long time or a job that you've been in for something that was very prominent in your life. Okay, that affected your life in a big way. Done. It's over. Somebody is probably traveling. They're traveling. They are. They're traveling to a new destination. Suddenly. Good luck. 